vlog is Shining Stars and welcome to my channel Shining Stars Soup. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of FabFitFun Editor's Box for Spring 2019. Now for those of you who aren't aware, uh, FabFitFun is a quarterly subscription box. They send out boxes, kind of lifestyle boxes, um, spring, summer, fall, and winter. So you are paying about $49.99 uh, per month per box, but they also offer this editor's edition. Now I did get a coupon for $30 off from uh, my subscription addiction. I mentioned that website in my last video and it ended up costing me $54. Whereas if you were buying this from America with the discount code, it'd be only $29.99. And I don't believe that code's valid anymore. You can check my subscription addiction to see if you can still... I think the code was like spring 10 or something. I don't remember. But anyway, without further ado, I am going to um, open the box. Now, as you can see, it's very spring themed. We got green and pink and yellow and flowers. Uh, I already cut it open. And there was one thing that I did peek at. And unravel just so I wouldn't be making a bunch of plastic noise on camera. All right, so they do include um, a little what's in the box. It does let you know uh, it's split up into sections, and it's pretty much you get your choice of this, that, or this. And I will be going through uh, those with you today. Uh, I do have a $15 off coupon for a first FabFitFun box. Now, if you would like the code, it is only valid till uh, May 15th, 2019. So if you would like $15 off your first box, just leave a note in the um, in the comments below and I will I'll give it to you. Here's of course, I got this in my spring box and getting it in the editor's box as well. $50 um, gift card to HelloFresh. Uh, I haven't tried it. Um, I do go to Costco for most of my shopping but they do offer you a $50 gift card now the little catch as you can say is that they split it up into two so it's only $25 off for your first two deliveries so you're not getting $50 off all at once they're splitting it to into two different deliveries so can't wait to do pictures on Instagram uh, you can follow me on Instagram at cfrail2 and this is uh, the beach, uh, the beach towel. So you had your choice of choosing either um, the beach towel for fifty dollars, which is made of one hundred percent poly microfiber, and it's made in China. Uh, a Yumi Kim hanging train case, which was I don't even know what a hanging train case is. Either way, it's complete with a hanger and fold out pocket for major storage. So maybe leave a comment down below if you have one or if you got the editor's box and leave a link to your unboxing so I can see what that thing looked like. Uh, that was worth $58. Or sunglasses, um, aviator style from Diff. I don't know if I'm saying that right, for $85. I did choose the sunglasses avi aviator style in my regular box, so that's why I didn't pick the sunglasses. And... Um, just skipping ahead a bit to this whole box while my spring, um, my regular subscription was $264 in value. This box works out to $304, so that's great. And um, yeah, so I chose the uh, the beach, the beach, beach please, which really, of course, sounds like you're saying something else. So I'm just going to say, beach please. Beach, please show me your towel. This is very thin. A lot thinner than I expected. Do I think it's worth $50? No. I'm sorry, but in my personal opinion, I would not pay $50 for this towel. If I were to, I'm disappointed if I were to see it on a magazine rack. I'll make <laughs> a beach towel rack. I would not buy it. All right, our next, um, this is one of the bonus items. So every box is going to get um, this. And this is a Summer and Rose uh, trinket dish. 
It's a fancy dish. All right, it's a fancy dish that's worth $22, which is what I believe the towel's actually worth. Let's be real. All right, so I'm gonna open this very carefully to show you what this looks like. Because honestly, I'll probably re-gift it. And it is pretty. I'm in, I, I did say I was gonna keep it in the plastic, but you know what? This plastic's gonna slide right back on. There you go. It's got a pretty gold and pink design. And um, Summer and Rose. This is actually, you know what, this is, this is really nice. This would be a great gift. Uh, Mother's Day coming up. Uh, don't forget, don't forget your aunts, your grandmothers, your stepmoms, your sisters, your mother-in-laws. <laughs> Give them a gift. Let them know what you're thinking about them, even if they, they don't have, um, don't have children. They might have cat babies, dog babies. And just let them know that, that you're thinking about them. Because everybody... Oh, oh, I'm going to put that back together later. <laughs> everybody deserves love, especially on Mother's Day. Alright, um, so yeah, that was um, sent in every box. That was in custom. They, they send out the trinket box for you. Alright, we are going to go to customization number two. Which, um, you did have a, a choice to, to do this. Um, so if you were, like... If you're not annual and if um, you were just doing this to try this like I was, you only get to choose two um, two items and the other looks like five choices. So the other three choices rather uh, they choose for you. So all right so you could either get the opal rose necklace for $40. Uh, Retail value is $40. It's designed in Los Angeles, the 18 karat gold plated. Um, opal necklace is the chic accessory you never need. Because I am not going to actually be wearing this myself. Um, to be honest with you, I'm, I'm disappointed in this necklace. Uh, on the preview, the picture looked much, much better. So this is another this is another flop in this box for me. As you can see, it's a very tiny stone, um, gold plated, 18 karat gold plated. I I'm not impressed by this necklace. I do not think it's worth forty dollars. But <sighs> am I happy that I that I chose this? No, no, I'm not happy. I chose the necklace. Your other choices would have been 11 by Venus uh, foldable gym bag, uh, which is a foldable duffel bag, spacious enough to hold your water bottle for $29 value, or the matte and shimmers uh, super pigmented shades uh, eyeshadow palette by Ish, and that would have been $32. Now, the reason why I chose the necklace is because I thought it would be more impressive than this. I mean, you can barely... You're, you're not really going to notice that if you if you wear it. Maybe I'm just too critical. If you can tell, I don't wear a lot of jewelry. But um, the opal necklace was $40. Okay. Next we have... This is a product I was looking forward to. It's a na nail and cuticle uh, serum strengthening. It's made by... Who is it? Who are you made by? Oh, Way of Will. Uh, it's worth $24. It's going to moisturize your nails. Uh, while protecting the cuticle against dryness and damage, it's enriched with uh, metal foam, argan oil, and vitamin E. It's, it's a very small bottle. You see that? You can kind of see that. It's... Um, cuticle cream. Next we have a Murad Renewing Eye Cream. This is worth $82. If this is really worth $82 in this size, which is supposed to, it features peptides and increases elasticity 
and minimize lines and wrinkles. This is over the value of the whole box in this one little item. And this was a maybe. This was a not guaranteed to get this item in the box. It was either between this or a cider vinegar hair mask. So I am definitely going to use this. And I am very impressed. Wow. $82. And it's a decent size. And it's renewing eye cream. Uh, yeah, I'm really impressed. And this next item I actually already got for in my spring, my regular spring box. So I'll be gifting that away. Uh, Levito body lotion, mandarin, orange, and bergamot. I'm sure a lot of people butcher that. And that is worth $19. And it's a citrus body lotion, dermatol, derma, derma. It's safe for sensitive skin. Uh, anyway, that's worth $19. The next product we have in here. It's a box on the floor. Uh, Ava. Ava. Uh, foot cream mocks me and it laughs at me for dropping my box on the floor. All right, this is for dry and sensitive skin relief. Foot cream. Uh, leave on Dead Sea mud. So you're supposed to leave this on your feet, apparently. And um, this one you could either get the This Works Deep Sleep Pillow Spray for 20, worth $29 or the foot cream, also worth 20, $29. And it relieves dry, cracked heels and coarse skin on your feet. I imagine you could also use this on your hands. I'm just going to take a look and see. Yes, 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 yes. One more item in the box. All right, we have Tarte Skin Care Drink of H2O. Uh, you could either get the Tarte Lights Camera Flashes 4-in-1 Mascara with $23 or this Rainforest of the Sea. Drink of H2O Hydrating Boost for $39, um, which I'm happy. I'm happy I got this one. Take a quick look. It doesn't really have much of a smell. It has a nice light, light color. All right, so I'm getting on 15 minutes here, and I think I only have a 15-minute limit. Uh, so quickly to run over the items in my box, I got the Tarte Drink of H2O Moisturizing Mask. We have the Intense Foot Cream, the Murad Eye Serum, the Opal Necklace, the Strengthening Nail and Cuticle, uh, the Body Lotion, the, 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 the Fancy Dish, and the Beach Towel. All right, so all together the value was $304. And yeah, that was the Spring Edit Box. So. Aside from a couple of the products I was disappointed in, this has gone over 15 minutes. I'll just edit it and cut it and bring it under 15 minutes. And then I can erase the dropping of the box. <laughs> and also I find that really funny. Maybe I'll include it. Uh, so my favorite products in the edit box were definitely the Drink of H2 H2O uh, by Tarte. I'm interested in trying this. Again, $39 worth. And the Renewing Eye Cream. That was $82. Remarkable value. I'm not doing very well. And the uh, foot cream. And the cuticle oil. And the little the little jewelry dish I was really impressed with. Um, necklace. $40. Big disappointment. And a towel. Big flop. Big flop. All right. That's, uh, that was my unboxing of my FabFitFun Editor's box for Spring 2019. Thank you all for tuning in. If you stayed this long, I'm so impressed with you. <laughs> if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. If you haven't liked the video, please like the video. If you don't, thanks for staying through right to the end. And I hope all you shining stars have a shining star day.